everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have an in the style haul for you. I bought a lot, like there is a lot more than I thought there was. It's because I did two separate orders and then the orders kind of came on the same day. So I was like, so this haul's a little bit different to my misguided haul because in the misguided haul I bought things in outfits whereas this one I bought it to go with things that I already had kind of thing and this is one of the items that's in it so is this as well actually oh I did well a lot of the items that I'm going to show you are knitwear items because obviously coming into the autumn and winter I need the knits now so I hope that you enjoy this video if you do please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already turn on the bell notification button to be notified when I put my videos up on a Wednesday at four o'clock. And yeah, we'll get straight into the video. item in this dress is out of, I hope that I didn't flash then. This dress is out of Francesca's collection and um, the majority of things that I've bought out of that like girl squad collection kind of thing are from Francesca's. The only thing I don't like about it, as you probably may be able to tell by me keeping doing this, is it accentuates my smile line here with my um, ninky nanky nanky news. So I'd probably wear like pulley and knickers with this. Never thought at 21 years of age I'd be wanting to wear pulley and knickers, but you know. I think this would be really cute if you paired it with like a leather black belt. For some reason, I don't know where mine's gone. Apparently I don't own one, which I really, really thought I did. I do. It'll be somewhere. I've just paired it with my black ankle boots by Topshop. So it's made out of a satin material. It is a one layer satin material. So it's, that's why it kind of accentuates that bit. You've got your little frill at the bottom. It's kind of like a two-tier thrill. It has a seam here, which pulls it in at the waist a little bit. You've got your frills on the front, which go all the way to the back. And then you've got your balloon sleeves with the cuffs at the bottom. I do think this is really, really flattering. I do love it. I do genuinely, other than my smile, because that's not the dress. That's me. I do love it, so. from the Francesca collection and once again I absolutely love it. I've never bought anything like this before so it's like a tailored blazer dress. The only problem I'm having with it is because I'm bigger busted. It's kind of been a little bit revealing here but that's going to be all right if you've got a black bra on. So the bottom is a skater dress and it's all pleated around the bottom so that's really really flattering. Comes in at the waist and you've got a little bow here. It's kind of a crossover blazer that fixes together with a little button. The material is quite thin once again. It's kind of like a thin cotton material with a sheen to it it's not nylon but it's definitely got a sheen to it it's quite shiny and then it's got these gold button details here which is right up on where my nipple is fyi the skirt does open at the front and it uh, would reveal your ninky nanky nonky news so it might be worth putting cycling shorts on with it and there's me really wow Items, which I am oh my god I'm so impressed with like both of them so we'll do the jeans first so these jeans are from the Joanna collection in the kind of girl squad power squad section they are super high waisted they're so flattering around the hips and around the bum area I got these in a size 12 I wasn't sure whether I'd need to go like a size up for the 14s but these fit absolutely perfectly I'm not even joking when I say I think these are the best fitting jeans I have ever had. I'm so happy with them. They're super long, so if you know me, you know that I have very, very long legs. My body's very weird and not proportioned. And they come right the way down to the bottom of my shoe. On the... Oh, Jesus. I just saw then that there is a slit on the bottom outer half of jean leg things right so they have two pockets on the back two pockets on the front they have belt loops the stitching i know that some people are really fussy about stitching so the stitching on these is the regular denim gold stitching and then you've got a silver button so it's kind of silver details and you've got the silver what are they called clickers so i'm seriously happy with those 
Then we have this bodysuit, which I'm really surprised at because cups on bodysuits don't usually fit me. So I'm really, really surprised that these ones do. They're not 100% perfect, but we get what we're given in this life. So with this bodysuit, you have the little lace underneath and then you have lace on like the top of the bust. Oh my God, cringe. I really love these little mesh sleeves and it's mesh across here. There's like corset details as well. So holding everything in place, making everything look like really flattering. And then at the back as well, you have the zip all the way to the top. So it's really easy to get in and out of and it's so comfortable. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing a bodysuit at all. So yeah, I mean, look. and this is a top out of the Francesca collection once again and this is completely out of my comfort zone it's not like something that I usually wear um, I have very broad shoulders so I don't particularly think that this is doing anything for me but I think it's so gorgeous you've got the mesh puffed sleeves at the top with like the polka dot detail on it then it cuffs at the bottom with the same knitted material as the top and I think this material here is really like complementary to your figure it's got a nice high waist and it is really comfortable the only uncomfortable thing about it is these sleeves are a little bit itchy um, and me suffering really badly with chronic eczema that is not going to be great so I need to get this off ACP. I think on other people's shoulders not as broad as me this will look absolutely amazing I do think it's really cute and I can really see this with like a little tartan skirt or something that would be great. <laughs> is this cream like cable knit jumper dress here and it is absolutely gorgeous so I would style this in two ways I would style it how I have it now kind of tucked into the jeans here and then with some boots or I would style it just put it all down like that belt around the waist and maybe some like high knee boots I think that would look quite cute so I'm going to put that back in there so I actually look like I've done something with it so it's a nice cream colour, it's a really chunky knit and it's not itchy at all, it's really soft. You've got the cable knit down here which is a lovely kind of detail and then they cuff in at the bottom. I think, yes, it also cuffs in at the bottom of the top as well. Then you've got this roll neck here. I don't know if it's a turtleneck, I call it a high roll neck. What? And yeah, I absolutely love it, I just think this is amazing for like the cold winter weather. I love it! I'm doing really well here with love everything. the Billy Fairs collection so once again it is a cream oversized knit jumper it pulls in at the bottom so you've got this really flattering like overhang hemline kind of thing and I really really like that it's bat winged so you know you need to air out the pits then you're all right <laughs> You've got another roll over high neck and I absolutely love these. It's really soft once again. I just think it's really flattering. It's different to anything I've ever worn, except when you do that, like. <laughs> I'm flying, Jack, I'm flying. I'm actually like the cringiest person, aren't I? A low key, feel like a nun. I do like it though. It's really different to anything that I've got, like I said, look easily. <laughs> Woo. Woo. <laughs> You definitely don't need to size up in this one because it is a big enough. You've got a lot of room in here. I really, really like it. If you're pregnant, very good for hiding that. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so I actually bought this as an outfit, but I'm having a real like change of heart so this skirt i think is from the charlotte crosby collection and i really liked it on her on the website but i'm just not sure about it on me it doesn't really suck me in at the waist or anything like that and that's what i like a skirt like this to do i like it to have a lot of pulling power at the waist and it just doesn't and i feel like if i got it any smaller i'd have no movement ah. it's really high quality i do think it is quite flattering i like the zip at the front this detail it's just not for me, personally. So then, surprise, surprise, I bought another white jumper. This one is kind of an oversized cropped jumper with slight balloon sleeves. It's nice and high necked. I absolutely love it. It's really cosy. It's just that, like, plaited 
wool. It is more of a cream colour than a white colour, but it's going to go with things that I want it to go with. So I'm kind of seeing it with a nice red and black, blue, green tartan skirt. A-line kind of thing. Um, I've wanted one of these jumpers for so long and I feel like this is exactly what I've wanted. It's really fra frattering. It's really flattering. I feel really comfortable in it. So, yeah. We'll see. Cable Knit Coward from the Billy Ferris collection and as soon as I saw this I fell in love with it. I wore it the day that it came, I was like oh my gosh I'm in love. I never thought that I would like coward sets like this because they don't pull you in. They like, you wouldn't think they're the most flattering things on the earth but I absolutely love them. It doesn't pull me in anywhere, it is see through so you can probably see my knickers right now. So I love the skirt, it comes up nice and high waisted, you really can see my knickers can't you? Just ignore oh i feel like um i feel exposed let's talk like this so the skirt <laughs> so you've got the gorgeous cable knit material down here it's kind of like a woven in and out material and then you've got the diamond like details here you've got cable knit right the way down there it cuffs in at the bottom and also cuffs in at the top it doesn't suck you in at all it doesn't do a lot for your figure but it is so comfortable and then you have exactly the same design on the top here gives you a little bit of like decolletage up at the top the straps here are larger than spaghetti straps i think it's really flattering especially if you have broad shoulders like me comes right the way out to the edge of your shoulder and does make them look a little smaller so i'm absolutely in love with this set and i just knew straight away that when i got it it was going on This is definitely the type of outfit that I saw it with. So I bought this maxi cardigan. It's gorgeous. It's in a camel beige colour. It goes right the way down to your arms. I think I bought this in a size 14 because I wanted it to be really oversized, which it definitely is. The woven detail on it is absolutely beautiful. There's a lot of different patterns, lines, plaiting. It is gorgeous. It's really comfortable, really warm. It feels really thick and good quality material. I basically saw it with like a little white crop top or a bodysuit and some shorts. You can obviously wear this in so many different ways, but I just think on an autumn, <coughs> my God, on an autumn winter night, it's so cozy. I'm so happy that I picked this up. It's so nice. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope that you enjoyed it and you liked some of these items. I will link all the items in the description box down below. I also post them onto my Instagram and my 21 Buttons account. So if you do have those, please go and follow me on there. I hope that you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you in my next one. Bye!